really bad things. Bruce Wayne, you should be rotting in a padded cell. Now, your butler, the man who raised you like his own son, will suffer in your place. But don't worry, you'll get him back eventually. Peace, my bloody peace. No. Alfred. Oh. oh my god. Ow. Ow. We have to keep a cool head, Lucius. Worrying isn't going to help Alfred. We need to focus. You're right. Let's get started. He's ex army, right? So he's like. Alfred keeps it. Gonna be fighting. Glasses. The reflection. He's making sure I see the reflection in his glasses. <laughs> he see? Knows he's fine. Computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the room that he's in. And I can view the virtual image using my cowl. Good thinking, Alfred. That's a stretch, but okay. Okay, Lucius. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Paint us a picture. Here we go. Oh, this is such a stretch. Well, first off, there's a camera. Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. Uh, insulation? Stairs? Stairs leading up. All that basement? Walls. We're in a basement. Yeah. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. Um, he's wounded. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Okay, looks like we've seen all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Uh, oh, a war here. Rogers Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use their records to find home addresses for their clients. I mean, we're getting closer. Does that really yeah, narrow it down? There yet. I don't think that narrows it down. Uh, what are you looking at? Oh, they're both looking at something. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Nothing else to see here. Moving on. Oh well, that's Lady Arkham. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Hmm, it's definitely something... This dude's looking at something upstairs. Oh, like a little metal place? And stamp. Only one Masonic Lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. Oh dear. So the house was built in 1945 by them. That's a big lead. Jump to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Wait, is that a bus stop? A basement window. What's that outside? Give me a second. They're by a bus stop. There we go. Okay, I think we have enough to pinpoint a location. Yeah, let's hope. Then why so itchy was then? He's... Okay, so, well, bus stops for a start. I can get the bus line from this, but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Okay, the build year. Okay, filtering for all homes built on that date. Uh, repair logs. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. And then the basements? Bowling alley. <sighs> Damn it. Let's keep looking. Okay. You are not going to believe this. What is it? Lady Arkham is back at the Vale House, where she killed her foster parents. What? According to its records, it has a basement. We know where Alfred is, but I'm without a working bat suit. Actually. <laughs> I did say bring a suit. Oh, that's such a cool looking suit. Early prototypes. It has basic cowl functionality, but outside of that, it doesn't protect much more than your identity, I'm afraid. Basically, don't get hit. 
Good call. Thank you, Lucius. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles, but it should still scare the crap out of criminals. Oh, that's so freaking cool. This ends tonight. Ooh, this is hype. This is hype. Let's finish this. Walks right through it. Psh. Oh, okay. Well, that's a trap. And there is a trip lane. Be careful. Please don't make me walk into that obvious trip lane. Oh. I'm all right. Guess there's another one. No? There's no one here. No Alfred. Damn it! There's blood on the walls. But we can look for clues. I'm going to see what I can find. Standing by. I gotta look at the blood spatter first. Maybe Alfred writ his blood splatter well, in a certain way. It means we can't be far behind them. Cheer. Maybe he peed this is where they the words from. of where he's going. Where they beat him. That was a weird animation. Uh, camera, heater. Boxes. Oh, blood trail. Wait, does it go through the wall? There's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, it goes under the wall. It goes under it. Sounds like there's more to this basement than it would appear. Taking a closer look. Now let's find out where the veils were hiding. Not really one for subtleties. There's a small room. Hmm. That'll be where Alpha is. The floor. A rope ladder. Can we put it down? Anyone down there would be trapped. Can we put it down? I'm going inside. Take the rope ladder for fuck's sake. What idiot. Oh my god, is this where Vicky was kept? As a child? Bruce, what's down there? Do you see Alfred? No. It's some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. What? Vicky. She was kept down here, locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child? It's why she killed the Veils. Yeah, because they, they tortured her. her. Jesus. I'm not saying what she did was right, but, but... I can't imagine what she went through. That's a reveal. The Veils' foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. I left his glasses. Oh, maybe he actually did write a message. Creepy. Disturbing. Vicky created her here, in this room. This. That's Lady Arkham. Is where Vicky Vale. Yeah. Became Lady Arkham. Oh, creepy shit, man. All right, let's look at some of the stuff. That'll be why she beat him with a belt. Oh, that poor the other kid must have been fucking shackles tortured as well. Old and new. 
Vicky did to Alfred what was done to her. Oh man, that is brutal. Absolutely brutal. Fingernails. Someone tried to climb out. Alfred? No. Maybe. Alfred's glasses. He can't see without them. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different. Newer. Can you isolate the new chalk? Cowell, isolate. I suppose maybe we need to know what type of chalk. One piece apart from the others. That's the colour he used. Is my tack. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe. Figures fleeing from something. Is that Arkham Asylum? They're gonna break them out of Arkham? Wanted to see what that says. This day will come at the pirate pit. I don't know. Some of the words have been highlighted. She will liberate. Oh, she will. Well, she will liberate Arkham Asylum. Alfred left me another clue. This is what he wanted me to find. To see. The newest chalk. He's added to an old drawing of Arkham Asylum. He drew figures outside the gates. Like they're running away. The words highlighted are she will and liberate. She will liberate. I don't see what that has to do with Alfred. Alfred's just along for the ride. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems. Including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors. Release Batman gets the it. And she took Alfred with her. Call Gordon in the GCPD. I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. That doll is so fucking creepy. Oh my god, are we actually going- oh my god, Arkham Asylum. Okay. Oh, this could be it. She might be here. Fuck, we're gonna see Joker again. Everything good? Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it then. The children of Arkham have taken over. Lieutenant Gordon says the GCPD are on their way. He's leading the team himself. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Does it really matter, though? I got this. We can deal with this ourselves, probably. See? This ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his payroll. Answer well, that doesn't matter. Question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll I just realized, is this his year one suit? That's freaking cool, man. Corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. No one's dying tonight. You really think you're in control here? Or is his new 52 suit? <laughs> Your confidence is impressive, but that won't save the butler or the rest of Gotham. A lesson needs to be taught. They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you, Vicky? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea. Oh my God! I put Harvey in here. This far. Too much to turn back now. I know you've suffered. 
You are tortured, held captive by the people who were supposed to love you. I don't know how you survived. You want to know how I survived? I survived. Because every night, I dreamed of the revenge I'd take on them. And this forsaken city. Your time's run out. I got that. Vicky! There's nothing you can do, Batman. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind bars. Open the doors! Uh-oh. Please don't be Harvey. Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! Well, one standing in your way. here we go. Time for a roll. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. Let me out. He's the crazy one. All right. <laughs> Write it. That was easy. Hey, Harvey. Jump over them. Oh. Do we have to be a goody two shoes? Oh. <laughs> Security systems offline. Every inmate's loose. Thanks, Steve Bloom. The children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. Oh my God, that was fast. Oh. Oh. It's amazing that she's not getting hit. You're not getting away, Vicky. That's not how the kill works. You can go into the light. I do love these sequences though, they're so freaking good. Um, I'm sure you can go in the kitchen. Just chuck him in the kitchen. Can I put a fork in his eye? Oh no, I'm gonna hit him with a chair. Obviously I need to hit him with a chair. That'd be amazing. Lightweight and accessible, especially for his face. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna taser this dude. Absolutely. Any more? Lady Arkham. Oh, there's Joker just sitting there. The light fixture. Well, there's Joker. Just sitting there chilling. Watch me plan out my moves. Oh, that's badass. Oh, wait, is he on fire now? Okay, that animation was broken. Dude, you should have thrown the bat ring. Oh. God damn it. Close though. I don't know if I hit that properly or not. But, it was enough to break the mask. Hey, Vicky. Fucking Zaz. That's the plan. Oh. <laughs> My God. Gordon. You are going to die. Jeez. Oh. Suplex. Oh, fill the table as well. 
truly inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person. <sighs> Jesus. Great. Didn't I just beat the shit out of all you guys? Can you just leave me alone? Gordon's here. We'll round up the rest of the inmates. You stop Lady Arkham. That's the plan. Oh god, this better be on the roof. This isn't on the roof of Arkham Asylum, then what was the point? Uh, okay. <laughs> I guess he was just interested in the. Oh, it's like the There's bathroom. No way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne came into this great. place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. Do you I can't know the help way? Those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. Oh, how convenient. He was underground. He was underground the whole time. Well, if the final boss fights in some random underground section, I can't complain about that. Alright, you've got hover boots. I'm so proud of you. I love the look of the suit. So nice. You're not well, Vicky. You need professional help. <laughs> Says the man dressed as a bat. I mean, you're literally dressed as like a doll. <laughs> Come on, go. Bruce, get up. The butler has to die. Can't Pain complain about your sore ribs. Sons. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If mm. you really want to save the butler, Bring me Bruce Wayne. If anyone can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12 inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards. Why should I trust you? Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. Ugh. I won't lie. You're the worst, Paris and Vicky. So You're the worst. I hate her. I actually hate her. Oh! That would have split me in half. Oh, it's a syringe. Vicky, stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. Sure you but have. And Hill deserved to die. No, they didn't. If anything, I did you a favor. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. No, we're not. You see that? We want the same things. Those men deserve their day in court, just like everyone else. Justice so they for all. Have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final. And absolute. It's not justice. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than Swan? He hides behind his status and wealth. Does he? He's a coward. Is that why he's here in a bat suit? He's. I've seen that one in Empire Strikes Back. Or is it Return of the Jedi? Doesn't matter. I've seen that one in Star Wars. There you are. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. So you say. You could have been looking up. What about you? You could have been a great journalist. Did you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? Hmm, that is the are question. You the man? Or the mask. The mask is a symbol. Some fear it. But for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. 
And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. You already have. It'd be funny if you said that. You already have. Howard. I was worried that my game crashed. Oh, jeez. Like an underground church in Arkham. Was she friends with the kids? Hold on, Alfred. You, you, you came, you came for me. Of course I did. After what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Uh, above you! Sorry, I'm <laughs> interesting how you speak to I'm him. so into this. So familiar? Alfred? <sighs> Such concern. For Maybe I'm Bruce Wayne. Never met before. Release him. Then we'll talk. <laughs> you know, I just don't believe you. I think Alfred may be the only way I can make you talk. It mm. makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Of course I care. Batman, don't you... Shut up, old man! You've seen my true self. Your turn. You've met me before. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really are. Fine. If that's what it will take to save you. No! No one will believe her. Bruce. This must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man Batman is. He only looks out for himself. Does he? Oh, but of course. <laughs> nice. Now I understand. Good time for the battery to die. Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, just like your father did. A true way. <laughs> That's how you want to see it. There's nothing heroic about you. You're right about my father. The things he did are unforgivable. But I am trying to make up for his crimes. I wear this mask to help people. I'm not some naive socialite you can sweet talk. I know a liar when I see one. Is there a mirror? Is there a mirror? Ooh. <laughs> Just blow a fucking hole in my ear. Ow. No more lies. No more talk. The only truth left is in your death. Rock her face. God oh, damn it. That was obviously never gonna work. This is hype. This is amazing. Oh. I'll bury you. Iron Man does that in the movies. Uses the thrust to kick. That looks really painful. She's trying to bring this pace down. Oh, so am I, apparently. Stop hitting me. Okay. 
finally broke that stupid staff. Now what? Stop, Vicky. It's over. Nothing will keep me from my revenge. You've had your revenge. Oh, jeez. Please stop bringing the place down. Literally bringing the roof down. Bruce, stop trying to break the place. Oh. Wait, what? It was telling me that I missed all of them. Oh. <laughs> oh. Still not over, huh? Yeah, literally, guys, can we stop bringing the roof down? Nice imagery. Buried and Gotham will not mourn. The sins of the Wayne bloodline end here. Oh, that's freaking awesome. Imagery though. Alfred, you good? Can we head out before this place collapses? What a horrible noise that was. I see your true face. I'll never trust you. gonna die here. Yeah. No, I know I know comic book movies and games. She's not really dead. There's no way she's dead. But I'll take it at face value for now. I don't believe she's dead. Nah. No way. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. <sighs> if the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. He's missing half Sorry. his ear. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I... I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did, sacrificing your identity for my safety. But uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain, gone. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that. After everything that's happened. Well, it's true though. And Bruce Wayne is a good guy. Uh, at least there's something left of it. <laughs> Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. You can get repaired, though, surgically. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. There's going to be more, though. Lady Arkham, Penguin, Harvey. 
They won't be the last to threaten Gotham. No. Likely not. But you'll be ready. Because I know meantime, there's a season two. Let us hope for some peace. Surely Joker. Peace. Maybe Harvey. I mean, Penguin's the still there. done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Hmm. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? Gordon can lead the city into but New Horizons. That Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. You can't help the town. You can't help. <sighs> Thank you, Alfred. You can't be Batman forever. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. Give it time. That is unfortunate. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. I think it's fair to say. Perhaps one is truly the mask. And one is who you truly believe you are. I think it's fair to say for this whole playthrough, we've tarnished Bruce's name enough. And we let Batman be the good guy. That perhaps it's time for Bruce to go into the spotlight. Let Gordon know. Bruce Wayne will be there. Batman He'll is already liked. Quite the impression Gordon will be great. And honestly, who cares if people don't like Batman? Gordon does. And the GCPD does. So we're going to go as Bruce. We're going to repair our name. We're better. We're all better than our parents. Oh Christ, he's got a cigarette on again. Commissioner Gordon. He is here. Commissioner Gordon. It doesn't sound right. That's you though. Don't worry. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. What uh, happened to your ear? It looks painful. Shaving. Myself shaving? Yeah. <laughs> What'd you use? A chainsaw? <laughs> Well, to be honest, I was surprised to get your call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor, I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss like that, I wouldn't blame you for lying low. He's not dead. What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. It's time I owned my family's past. Yeah. Take responsibility for what my father did, so we can all move forward. You know, that can't be easy. But I'm glad that you're here. I was half hoping Batman might show up, too. I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. Not to mention... He makes one hell of an impression on people. Well, too bad he's not here. Wouldn't mind meeting him. Just kind of blow yeah. off. <laughs> well, he's not much of a talker. They're ready for you, Commissioner. 
You know, during times like these, it can feel impossible. I just realized though, what's going to go wrong? Something has but to go I wrong. Hope. hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Please don't go during wrong. In the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together Please to don't fight go wrong. those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Thank All right, you, let's Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. Let's own up to our parents' <laughs> problems and I'm tell here them today that to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses, and some of those losses came at the hands of my own father, or at least as a result of his actions. Uh. I would yeah. like to take this opportunity to apologize. To tell you how sorry I am for the pain the Wayne family has caused this community. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. And to that end... Oh... Uh, bear. Stronger police force. A closer force. alliance between the GCPD and Wayne Enterprises will provide the police force with the support with the training and the equipment they need to make Gotham safer than it ever has been before. The GCPD will be the most technologically advanced police force in the country because the people of Gotham deserve to feel safe. I wasn't even holding the controller. Who the hell are you? Clear the area. Get that bastard to lock up. The hell was Just minutes ago, Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. He sure does clean up well. Uh. See you soon, Bruce. <laughs> Sequel bait. Sequel bait. Well, I obviously knew that was going to go wrong. Ah, <sighs> anywho, did you successfully distract Penguin? You can fail that. Oh, jeez. Uh, well, I did. M me and the majority of people did. Oh, quite a big breakdown of this one. Did you blame Alfred for his involvement? Wow. Almost, basically, 4% of people blamed Alfred. He's harsh. You and 91% of people regarded Selena as more than a thief. Interesting. Because she is a, she is a thief. Um, <laughs> interesting. That's really, really interesting. Hmm. Wow. Again, I'm surprised by that. 73% 70, of people revealed their identity. And only just about 27% people didn't. Y yeah. Because who cares about Batman? You know, 60, 61.5% of people showed up to Gordon's address as Bruce. Why would you go as Batman? It doesn't make any sense why you would go as Batman. 
Wow. I mostly fit into the majority except for... Actually, no, to be fair, I think actually the Alfred one is the majority. It's just, it looks like it's not. I know, 70% of people comforted Alfred, saying that he wasn't to blame. Well, I'm not in the majority for that one. But, everything else is all push. Oh, you can get a, an overview. Alright, what does my overview say? Oh, this is pretty cool. Your Batman slash Bruce was compassionate. <laughs> the crusade to defend Gotham is about helping people, being a beacon of hope in a dark world, to use one's strengths to lift people up instead of just beating villains down. Pretty true. I was bru I was brutal as Batman, but I was cunning and self-reliant. What does it mean by honest? Collaborative. Hmm. Maybe a collaborative because I wasn't... Sorry, maybe self-reliant because I was working with... Um, or sorry, I, I refused to work with Vicky in the, at the beginning of the game. And maybe if I brought Lucius with me uh, to Wayne Tower, maybe that would have been collaborative. And if I was honest... Uh, I feel like I've been honest. I don't know why it says cunning. And obviously I've been pretty brutal <laughs> with the whole thing, but I, I didn't kill... I didn't assault Falcone at the beginning of the game. Uh, I did break that guy's arm, to be fair. Mm, I've been mostly merciful for the most part. I haven't gone out my way to hurt and maim people. I didn't assault uh, Harvey in the flat either. So, yeah. Is that all? That's all. Awesome. That's us. Well, we've just beaten... Batman the Telltale series. Wow, that was incredible. I can't wait to play. Um, cannot wait to play season two. I don't know why I, I, I totally stopped there. I'm so overwhelmed with emotion and everything that just happened. It's just, I'm so exhausted. The emotion, the feeling, like it was so much fun. And I love Telltale games. I think they tell stories better than potentially probably most games in, the, in on any market or any stories in any market. It's like a choose your own adventure book, except it's a game. And the stories that they tell are just so, well this one in particular is so dark and so faithful, or at least that I think it's faithful to Batman. It's so, so good. Um, if you liked what you saw, then please drop a uh, subscribe, drop a like as well, and maybe put in a comment on your favourite moment of the series. If you want to see Season 2, then let me know, because I absolutely want to play Season 2, and I hope, uh, I'm sure I'm going to get through Season 2, and I hope there's a Season 3 at some point. And yeah, I'm going to leave you with that, and I'll see you in the next one.